Huge warm welcome to the Art Vlog Art Lovers with me, George Dopamine. I'm here at the National Portrait Gallery in London to bring you the show, The Time Is Always Now. Artists redefine the black figure. Um, I'm really excited about this show because it contains artists I love, like Barbara Walker and Claudette Johnson. But I'm also really excited to learn about new artists because this show is part of an ongoing revolution in the UK art scene to put artists of colour their, in their rightful place in our major institutions. And it's been a voyage of discovery for me over the last few years and hopefully for you as well. I'm particularly excited because there's lots of artists I've already covered on the vlog being shown here, like Labena Hamid, Hervin Anderson, Chris Philly, and many, many more. So come and join me as we go inside and explore this show, which is on until the 19th of May. It's £16 to get in. Um, and this is the third show I bought you from the newly um, refurbished National Portrait Gallery after Paul McCartney, Eye of the Storm, and the wonderful David Hockney show. So let's hope this matches up to these two. Come and join me as we head inside.
I really hope you enjoyed that exploration there of um, the time is always now from the National Portrait Gallery. I thoroughly enjoyed that show. I'm buzzing. Hopefully, as you saw, the quality of the art was fantastic. Um, there were so many great artists. Yes, it was great to get to know, uh, get to see again, sorry, the ones that I love, like Barbara Walker um, and Claudette Johnson, who give, whose work gives me collie wobbles. But also, it was great to get to know some new artists. I love Noah Davis's work. It was so highly charged, like the Black Wall Street piece or 1975, the swimming pool piece. And I really liked um, Jennifer Packer's work as well. It was slow, deep. You could see that she returned to these works again and again. Um, Matt Griffiths, you said, thank you in the comments, that Entangled Pass was like a primer for this show. And I am inclined to agree. Um, I really like the theming. I thought that um, the three themes of the double consciousness, the persistence of history, and our aliveness were really well. It was well curated, it was tight, and my only criticism really was that it wasn't big enough. I wanted to see more. The exhibition starts by saying this is an attempt to provide a full range of black portraiture from all great black artists. But it is, it is um, a bit small. I went round it so quickly, I wanted it to go on and on. And I think maybe for £16, it could have been a bit richer. I still really recommend it. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. I thought there was some fantastic art on show. It's on until the 19th of May. So do get along. And I hope that, I hope that you can get there. Don't forget to subscribe to the Art Vlog. Hit that notification bell. And most importantly of all, get out there and explore your local art scene.